35 year old Russian influencer that got famous for her weight loss surgery. Oh, I thought it was has, Boris. Has recently um, gained it all back. No, has come funny. under some, like, there's some controversy. What? Oh, like, she did actually lose it. Like, she, like, just got it cut off. It actually has yeah, nothing wait, to do with her weight loss. Uh, <gasps> she said she got surgery. What? Did you say she got surgery? Or just weight loss? No, just her weight loss journey, but uh, it has nothing. I mean, that was just the reason why she's popular. She was just uh, saying, like, this is why she's, like, some famous influencer exactly. person. That's, yeah, yeah. that's her claim to fame, is that. But. There's this whole controversy going on around her because she has divorced her 45 year old husband who <gasps> she had been married to for 10 years <gasps> and they shared five, like they adopted five um, oh, kids. Cats? No, five kids. And uh, they then he had two boys from a previous marriage and He's now- a collector, huh? Yeah. Collector seven kids. kids? Seven kids. I mean, he must be rich though. Let me guess. She doesn't want to take care of them. <gasps> no. Uh, I mean, she really wants to take care of one. Uh, <gasps> Ew. He must be hot. He's having a relationship with the step? With the stepson. Oh, that's like a porno. <laughs> with her 20 year old stepson. Whoa. That's like a dream. Oh, whoa. oh no. Wait. Oh my God. Seven. Wait, this, the lady raised that little yeah. dude and what that little dude grew up to be that. Psycho. And then now they're. Freaking what, big and ugly. ugly. It's yeah. like, uh, what's his face? Yeah. That one director? What's his name? Uh, with the big glasses. Oh, Woody Allen. Woody Allen. We have Woody I Allen. keep wanting to call him Woody, Woody Nelson. Allen. I'm like, that's not his name. You know, it's interesting that she looks younger when she's older and she, she looks. Weight. She lost a lot of weight. So, this so is, when you're fatter, you look older? This is her yeah. transformation. Like, the that's race is disgusting. disgusting. You know what's really disgusting is she's an influencer. That is disgusting. No, I mean, like, um, she kind of sucks. What are you, what are you talking, talking about? <laughs> she just because she's an influencer. No, no, no. Like, like this is the caliber of an influencer. I expect more. She sucks. Yeah, she does uh, suck. She sucks as a person. Right a lot of people. That's true. Mm -hmm. She sucks at everything. She sucks at momming, marriage. Damn, well, she's, she's here. pretty she attractive. <laughs> to her, she might be the best mom. Four hundred thousand followers. Yeah. Damn. They look like a cute couple. She got a big following. It's I want to know in the comments because you know sometimes there's, there's all it's never one sided. I want to see who's on her side. I like that dog. I don't know, man. I feel like there's people, a bunch of people. Okay. That are no, like, uh, the people that are on her side is like, well, fuck it. They're two consenting grown adults. They can do whatever they want. No, like they're not blood. He knows she cooks good and takes yeah, care of them blood. really good. So what if we're just blood. judging with our judgy American values? I'm gonna judge with my own American values because if I'm raising a uh, person as my child, yeah. even though we're not blood related, they're forever my child. That's I think true. outside of that too, like we're thinking of the red flags of like, did she condition that's him? That's exactly what a lot right. of people are oh, saying. Oh, that's what you're thinking? That's what I'm thinking. I was thinking maybe in the, Rus in the Russian ways, they're like, you're always, Half romantic, half not. Is it? Is that <laughs> I don't know. I don't Interesting. Know. <laughs> just know the just like from that. the start, you know. What oh. Does the conditioning? <laughs> you know the Russian better than I do. How do you think the relationship between the son and the dad is now? I know they must be best pals. He's like, what? bro, you stole my wife. <laughs> They're Eskimo brothers. Yeah. What is that? They both share, they the, share same, the same mask. The igloo. He's a true motherfucker, is what I'm thinking. I never heard mm -hmm. that one. Really? Eskimo She's an igloo. Brother. Eskimo mm -hmm. brothers? Get that. Yeah. Oh. Eskimo brothers is you share the same lady. Never heard that. Because he's like, Daddy, don't call me daddy. We are not brothers. <laughs> daddy. Eskimo brothers. He goes, no, brother. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, so now because of this relationship, um, well, so they have made an announcement that they're they're planning to get married, and because of this relationship coming to light, the, the child services they have now taken away all the other kids, her adopted children, and placed them with her ex-husband. What if she's like, they're all ugly though. He was the cutest one. <laughs> <laughs> He's the one I wanted. Oh God, what a nasty situation. Are they about to have kids? Please, no, please, no, please. I think no. they want to. Well, they're not blood related, right? They're not, but it's. What do you think? Do you think, oh, say you adopted a bunch of kids, right? And then you started dating one, and then child services took away all the other ones? Do you think that's fair? Of course. Okay. Well, I mean, wait, but I'm the one dating my own kid? No, no, you're the, the, the son of your husband. Well, yeah, in this situation. But they're actually, three of them are hers. Right? No, no, they're adopted. No. Oh, they're adopted. She doesn't have any biological children that I know of. Thank God. Five of them are adopted with her ex-husband, 
and then he had two two boys from a Hi. previous marriage which this kid that she's yeah maybe she can't have kids that's why they adopted maybe so, so he could sure, cream pie out right? in her all day with, uh, what does that have to do with the no because then uh i think you asked if they're gonna have kids no no do you oh. think that's what would you like is that weird to you what's weird Taking away the of kids. Of course. Yeah, because yeah. I think they're thinking about the same lens we're thinking about, where it's like, is she conditioning them like she's conditioning him? I was just thinking like, she's probably like, hell yeah, I don't gotta take care of these motherfuckers and me and my, my new son boyfriend can start a new life. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe they're like, we don't want these kids son to boyfriend. call their brother also their dad. Yeah, that's oh. weird. Like, and Which word do you use whenever you feel like one or the other? It's like, oh, my my new sibling Uncle Dad. Is, yeah. yeah. Once if he was the youngest, and he starts disciplining the other kids now. Because technically he's their dad. Bro dad. Damn, so he has to do Mother's Day and Valentine's Day. For her. <laughs> for the same person? I know, dude! That's weird, huh? Wait, don't you do that for weird. Jill? True. True. Yeah, but you don't celebrate. Not as like, like your own. Dog. You're like the Mother's Day of my child. Like you're not yeah, Mother's yeah, yeah. Day. Thank you for raising me. Yeah, I don't go Happy Mother's so Day he that way. So caption. He's ra he's literally saying thank you for raising me and fucking me. Thank you for raising me and giving me blowjobs. <laughs> do you think? Do you think they uh they <gasps> ignore the fact that they're mother and son, or do you think they play like play into it? Oh, oh God. God! I hope they don't play. I into bet they it. play into it. I bet they play into it. Yeah. And then, and then, when they think about memories that are like mother and daughter, I mean, like mother and son, it's like remember the time when you took me to the park and you were like, I cried when I went down the slide and shit, and then they turned it romantic. Now we can fuck on that slide. I want to know when they started that stuff. Very true. That's a yeah. really vital question. Yeah. When? That's the conditioning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, what if yeah. he conditioned her though? I know. He might have been the pervert. Yeah. One mind's much more malleable. I don't know. It's the lady's mind, probably. That's true. I don't know. I was quite the jail bait, but I failed because I wasn't a good looking kid. I always try to. What would you do, Joe, if you had a really hot stepmom? <laughs> it's a stepmom, right? How desperate am I? This kid. And do I think she's hot? Yes. And then, like, what if they. St I mean, I don't know. Like this photo that she posted to me oh, is she so posted it herself. Oh, she posted this. That's weird. She's proud of it. Look, I'm a man of honor, and if I like my dad, I'd be like, "Mom's hot," but that's all you, dog. No, people were commenting saying like, "Oh my gosh, she traded in her husband for a newer model." That's weird. Cause get that's this, get this, get this, get this, get this. Cause like sometimes, all right, you know, like the stereotypical rich dad, right? So like he's like fucking going through a midlife crisis, he divorces the mom and he gets with a girl that's younger than you and hotter than anybody you've ever seen. So I'm pretty sure there's always situations like that where they see like this hot ass new girlfriend that your dad gets with and you're like, mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm, I'll fuck your son. Yep. what do you do there? I'm not even talking about porno, I'm talking about stereotypes, that shit happens. Thank God I'm not rich. Yeah. What, what happens if she fell in love with the husband, right? And like, he was amazing to her, and then something happened where he went bad. Yeah. But he still saw the old husband. In, in the, the kid? In the kid. Oh, that's what, what happened. Maybe he's abusive, we don't oh, know. Maybe the dad's yeah. a piece of shit. Maybe that's what happened. Because there's two sides. Yeah. Oh yeah, and he's like, you remind me of your dad when I met him when he was younger. Not Ooh, I want to vomit. I don't, I don't give a fuck if there's two sides. You the, can't do uh, that with Taika? What? <laughs> he reminds you of me a lot. No! <laughs> what are you well, talking about? Well, more like Jill than you. Yeah, but his personality, the way he acts, he acts like me. You be, Taika right now looks like you copy and paste Gio's <laughs> face inside. Yeah. It's just his head is bark. <laughs> yeah. His head shape. That's it's disgusting. Fucking, what compels no. a person to do some shit like this? Okay, like, because I can't think of a, in a female's perspective, right? But to me, it's like, you hear these stories of like lady teachers mm -hmm. that bang their students and all guys are kind of like low-key thinking I wish that was me. Yeah. She's so hot. But then in this case, I don't feel that way because she's fucking ugly. You look <laughs> at those news stories <laughs> and, it's, and, it's, and it's her mom. Yeah. <laughs> she's saying this is a mom. It's yeah. not even it's not yeah. even a teacher, right? But what kind of <laughs> mind takes a, a mom to want to fuck her kid? That's the weirdest but shit. It's yeah, crazy because for us, it's even this, like just us talking about it, it would be a whole different story if it was the dad doing that to her daughter. Do you know what I mean? 
Yeah. Well, he would have gone to jail. Well, we we just talked about the director. <laughs> yeah. Huh? Woody Allen. We just talked about Woody yeah. Allen. Is that what he did? He adopted yeah. a Chinese girl or something, and yeah. now they're married. And they've been together mm -hmm. for however many years, and he divorced his wife. So, mm -hmm. is that true love? Because, I mean, they didn't break up. That's kind of got, what got him canceled, right? Yeah. I mean, Thank no, God. He's he still been. making stuff. Is he making no, stuff? After that, he still did. But it didn't go anywhere. But don't they say all is fair in love and war? <laughs> so is it okay to do whatever it takes to find your true love, even if it's banging your mom? It makes or, me feel weird. Or banging your daughter or your son? Or your father? It's disgusting. There's so many people. You know oh, that saying? There's so many fish in the yeah, sea. Yeah. yeah. There's a. It's a fucking wide and vast sea. Go find another fish, you fucking but sick what if, bitch. What if, what if, but what if? What if? Oh. What if they're like? What if they look at us your and they go, "You're so basic." <laughs> <laughs> you don't love your family the way I do. Maybe that person's like, Ugh. "The grass is always greener." I got my green grass right here, baby. Why don't they're just so like minimalistic and like simple? They're like, I don't want to have to do shit. Yeah, they know? don't want to. Why, why, why would I have my mother and my lover in two different people if I could put them? I want to organize Ooh, them together. Efficiency. Consolidate my family. Just keep it in peace for the whole Valentine's Day, Mother's Day thing. They're just like, let's just make that one holiday. Yeah. So much Mother's efficiency. Gross. Yeah. Mother's time. Mother's time. <laughs> They're really just very minimalist thinking. Ooh. Maybe it's also green for the earth. I think if you spend enough time with someone, they're no longer sexualized. And I think that's what's so weird. Or maybe that's the challenge. <laughs> you gotta spend enough time and still try to sexualize. He goes, oh we God. have true love because we spent all our lives together. We still horny for each other. Oh! And then they're like, you wish he was jealous. Oh! I bet you can't kiss your mom like this. <laughs> Cause you know how we had that question a while ago? It was like, okay, imagine if you had like a long lost sibling and you never fucking met them, but yeah. they're hot as hell yeah. and you get together, right? Like that Jon Snow question. Or it's like, no. you grew up with a step sibling, but they're, you're, maybe you're not even blood related, maybe they're adopted, but you've been with them all your life, right? And some people were like, yeah, I'd rather be with the step sibling because we're not together together. And other people were like, nah, I'd fuck my biological sister that I'd never met. Fuck, I don't know. Can I just kill myself? Oh, we have to pick one or the other? We have to pick one or the other? We had this question a while back. Russia, you have to. I said, I said I would rather fuck my biological sister that I never fucked No! Met. You know why? Uh, they probably look good because no they look like me. And there's no history. Yeah, there's no history. That makes more sense. It makes way more sense. Like psychologically Yeah, wise. psychologically. Like if you grew up no, with the person. It's not though. They're both. I, I, I agree because of the no biological. I mean, because of the no history. But if you decide to be in love and start a family, that is already like. No, I'm talking about like Jon Snow. Snow. Like Jon Snow. Nature won't let you. You know, like Jon Snow. And you make there be less orphans in the world. Yeah. See, then you're doing good. I'm talking about what if you had a passionate time with them and afterwards you find out and you're like. Ah, fuck. Yeah, what would you feel like? Say you had sex with both? No, I'd one you would like know. Jon Snow and yeah. I'd be like, well, you gotta fuck two sisters to figure out what you want? <laughs> no, no, say you fuck uh, her, right? And then you're like, and then you find out that she was actually your real sister, right? Yeah. Or, so, okay. So, you already did it. You already did it. My and then now God. thinking about it, and then you're like, oh my God, that's crazy, right? Yeah. And then someone was, came along and was like, would you rather have done that or fuck your fake stepsister now? Knowing that she is, I mean, you grew up with her. I think the, oh. the stepsister mm -hmm. is worse, yeah. even though in porno today that's more acceptable. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But I rather do a. To me, it's like biologically, yeah, but we were separated. And we're com I don't. We're complete strangers. Oh God. What yeah. about say okay? Say you're 18 or 17, right? The cat fell asleep. And so. then I know. And then your dad married another person, and they had a daughter around the same age, and you guys just met. Is that bad? Because you guys are just now became stepsisters. And brothers. Yeah, there's so many technicalities. Are you pitching huh? us your movie right now? Huh? Are you pitching <laughs> us your movie right now? Movie ideas. You know That's what it. they say, incest, wincest.